once you make that decision, once you like cross that line, like I'm going to do this, you just have to like, I, I just had to constantly remind myself why, um, why, what I was driving for and what was really pushing me. I had a lot of days where I was like, I don't think this is gonna work out. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna go take a cushy job. I mean, I was getting my MBA at the time when I was starting this. So I had all the options in the world open to me. But, um, you know, every time I would have a bad day, something inside me said, you know, this is, this is what you need to do. This would be the best job in the world. Um, you can't let this vision die. And, and usually the bad days were like, because I had a bad meeting. There's some VCs that just weren't very friendly to my, uh, to my idea and to me particularly. And that was hard because you take it personally when a VC doesn't want to invest in you. So it's, it's more of like this, this mind game you play on yourself. You have to convince yourself, you know, in the good times and the bad times, it's gonna work out. You have to do everything. You can't let it bring you down. Because you're gonna have a bad meeting, you're gonna have, you know, a negative day, and you're gonna either let it make your entire project worse off, or you can just like brush your shoulders off and get up and keep going. You have two choices. Um, and unless you're ready to throw in the towel, you gotta just be strong.